It was a gathering of eminent Asian sons and daughters from different parishes in a Doe state, including prominent Catholic priests who accorded the Romy Bishop a befitting welcome. In a welcome address, Archbishop of the Catholic Archdiocese of Benin, Most Reverend Dr. Obiora Kubeze, eulogized Reverend Donatus Ogun for his dedication to the service of God and humanity. This is the Shepherd of Diocese of Romy. And he's doing well. And from their remarks, from the opening remarks, you saw what the, they said they hear what he's doing as far as evangelization is concerned. He's opening up new parishes and then, you know, building structures that will help the work of evangelization. So we, we are to assist him to do more. Chairman on the occasion, Chalivia Joseph Ujamai, and the event coordinator, Sir Andrew Agemome, congratulated the Bishop of Catholic Diocese, Uromi, on his installation as second bishop of the diocese. They highlighted numerous achievements of the bishop since assumption of office, including tremendous progress in evangelism and infrastructure. Other achievements are establishment of parishes, nursery, primary and secondary schools, improvements of facilities and standard at St. Camillus Catholic Hospital and building of a gigantic cathedral for the diocese. We have all participated and watched your movement, your activities in our land, and we see that much progress that have been made, and we are very happy and grateful to God that the choice was well made and well placed among all the people around. Most of us here today have played key roles before and during the creation and erection of Uromi Diocese. The Bishop of the Catholic Diocese of Uromi, Right Reverend Donatus Ogun, expressed appreciation to the Catholic faithful for their support so far and sued for more. Well, I have come with joy at their invitation to see them and to celebrate them as a son, sons and daughters and to remind them that they are very important for us. Some parishioners described the priests as truly ordained to cater for them. We feel very happy and proud that we have been honored by our home bishop coming to felicitate with uh, us. I believe this is the first time that the bishop is visiting Benin. The ace and people living in Benin City, they decided to receive our bishop, all of us who are his ancestors, daughters in Benin are very happy to receive our chief shepherd. A mass was earlier held where the bishop of Uromi Diocese offered prayers for parishioners. Adesua Lato reporting.